Hi, welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Sagittarius. Welcome back, my loves. Welcome to your love reading. I hope all has been well, Sagittarius. Hope you've been taking care of yourselves. Shout out to the beautiful soul tribe. Thank each and every one of you all, as always, for your continuous love and support. Your love never goes unnoticed on this platform. I truly hope you all are being able to take away each and every day of a stage of enlightenment to allow your spirit, your soul to evolve here right along with me. Thank you so much, Soul Tribe. It is an honor and I am appreciative to have you all in this beautiful environment here with me, all right? And welcome, Archers, to the ones that are new here. Thank you so much for tuning in today. Don't forget to like, subscribe, all right? We would love to have you as well a part of our soul family. And be sure to share this content, the message here today with who you know the reading today may resonate for, all right? And set your bells for when I do go live on this platform. I do go live throughout the week, just about every day for all Zodiac sign readings. And I do energy check-ins as well. So you don't miss out on any new content that I post on this channel. Set your bells and check out the community board where I do post upcoming content for you all as well all right so no further ado archers let's go ahead and dive in let's see about this person here today that is on your mind all right first card we have here is the six of pentacles this card talks about giving even exchange energy okay there is someone that's in your space that is in the giving mood they're in the receiving mood or just in a mood where they want to be in a partnership or a connection with you where they see you as rather if this is a lover rather if this is a friend uh rather if this is a family member all right this is a person that actually doesn't mind putting in the same effort the time or love with you all right sagittarius the scales here represent libra energy as well this is libra energy libra number all right so some of y'all this person may be a libra all right a libra could be very significant here archers all right let's see what else we have the hermit cards here, Virgo energy here. Some of y'all, this person could be a Virgo. So the good thing I see with this space and energy of this person here that's on your mind, Archers, is that they are going through a phase of healing. They are going through a phase of evolving and understanding their own path, their own journey, and even looking through their own past experiences with things that they are proud of about themselves and things that they may not find themselves very proud of, okay? But they're healing through that stage. They're learning to not blame others for their situations or circumstances here, even if this was someone that done this to you or blame you for their behavior patterns. This is someone now that is getting an understanding of what is right from a perspective of what is not right, okay? So either if this is someone that done this again to you or someone from their past or even seeing how someone was treated with someone else that treat them this way, they were able to isolate themselves is what the hermit does to be able to rectify the situation to see if even... You know what? That may not be the person for me. Let me exit that relationship here. Let me come over here with Sagittarius. I feel like me and Sagittarius has more of an understanding of each other here with the Six of Pentacles energy. And I feel like Sagittarius will put more in the relationship or the connection and give me the same amount of energy in return without draining my energy, without manipulating me or having me to look over my shoulders necessarily here. It's how this person is viewing this whole circumstance, situation, or even connection here with you, Archers. Wow. Wow. Let's see what else about this person here. We have the six. Oh, you see that? That number six wanted to come out again. So the number six is very significant. The number six is a universe number and it also is feminine energy. Okay. Uh, but we got the two of cups here. This is count serious energy as well. Some of y'all, this person may be a counselor here, but this card talks about unified love. This card talks about, again, partnerships, attraction, proposal, marriage, connection. So there is someone here, Sagittarius, that you're vibing with. Someone that is understanding you for who you are. And I feel like you're understanding this person for who they are as well. You're getting to an attainment here with somebody. Okay. 
Okay, again, this could be a water sign. This could be an earth sign here. Or again, this could be a Libra here, a Taurus, a Virgo, a Cancer here as well. All right, wow. Let's see what else about this person here. We got the Nine of Wands. Now, this is your energy here, Sagittarius, okay? We know the Nine of Wands talks about remaining and having the strength of courage here to move on, to set boundaries here. So I feel like you all are making sure that you set these type of expectations, not only for this person, I feel like, but just for you. Uh, I feel like through all these experiences here with these different ones here standing behind this person, they were able to understand through each and every one of these experiences or situations or circumstances, these experiences here from their past taught them to have boundaries with everything, with everyone. So everything could be on one accord. Everything can be in moderation. And there's not no mistreating no one. All right. It's what I feel like some of you all archers have now realized through your own path and journey when it comes to your partnerships as well all right wow archers oh my goodness if the reading here so far is resonating for you smash that like button all right let's get a little deeper here let's clarify a couple of the cards and then we'll close out with my index cards here to see what this person here wants to say okay wow look at that yep we got the eight of five 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 on the clock as i am saying this we got here the eight of pentacles here so five 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 talks about sudden change unexpected change so i feel like there's going to be some unexpected news you might be surprised by this person or how they present themselves to you again we got virgo energy here a virgo could be very significant both of these cards represent virgo energy and wow we got virgo energy again for the ten of pentacles some of y'all this person is all about wanting to build generational wealth with you or they're wanting to work towards this relationship here with you archers so that way if you two are mind finding yourselves maybe even blending families with each other here someone doesn't mind put it in the effort the time into this connection here because they've grown and evolved over time here with this hermit card here okay yes i love it let's clarify here the two of cups here please wow again if the reading so far is resonating sagittarius and smash that like button all right show my spirit team some love and if you would love to book a personal reading archers to kind of get more of a further outcome with you and this person my email details is down below in the description box okay Wow, this person see you as the empress or the emperor. Take it how it resonates for you. You may see this person as your empress, okay? Or you may see this person as your emperor. But this is someone that thinks very highly of you. They feel like that you have it all, okay? You're beautiful. You're gorgeous. You're handsome, all right? You're very attractive here. And this person loves how you have everything well put together for yourselves. And this person sees the potential that you two can actually build as far as a family, generational wealth together, being able to pass on your fruit of labor with each other and your family okay wow archers i love it so let's get some cards out here yes use my raw tarot index cards here to see what this person here wants to say to you okay oh wow Look at here, Sagittarius. We have let's take it slow, okay? Yeah, well, that would be the smart thing to do. I love how this person is thinking already, Sagittarius, by wanting to get to know you, not rushing into anything if they know that it's going to be well worth it at the end, right? And you really allow this person to feel their best when they are around you. And because of that, I see this going somewhere for you two in the future. I kind of feel like you guys may feel like, you know what? This might just be the one. <laughs> this might just be the one. But I'm not going to get my hopes up. But this just might be the one, Sagittarius. Okay? Wow, Archers. What a beautiful message here today, as always. Again, don't forget to like, share, subscribe if you're new here. Welcome, welcome. Come on over to the memberships for Patreon or the YouTube channel if you would love to have more extended energy and exchange i would say like here from me all right i would love to have you a part of our soul family i love you archers and i wish you and this person the best like subscribe and i see you in the next reading Mwah. bye bye